Welcome to Awakening You channel. If you appreciate what we do, please support us. Thank you. Dear Mother or Father God, humbly request guidance love and support for all who may be guided to this transmission, through any and all your beings wishing to share with us. Deep breaths, please help me to be clear conduit, and taint this message as little as possible with the, little me. Blessed dear heart, request granted. We are overjoyed that you have stuck with it this time, as there is much that can be shared through little you. As this is just a facet of the brilliant jewel of all that is, there is no thing more special than any other. These types of reaching into all that is, is available to each and every being in existence. All that is required is your all. And reaching into this all requires effort. This effort is not being put forth by all that many as of yet. This all is accessed in so many forms, your art and music, poems and every new, creation brought forth into the world you as yet can see. So shall we share a bit about your missions here, now. Know this, that this ascension process is very real, very important and it is not for every being incarnate here to just simply raise their vibrations, and so bring forth the uplifting of this realm you are a part of. Much more is asked of many of you. To those whom much is given, much is asked. All around you you see that this that has developed is not working. The one society of which all of you are a part, has not been one of unity. Divide and conquer, is what has been perpetrated here. This does not fit the new world you are creating. Unite and prosper. This is what is happening now. And when we say unite we are not just talking about you here on earth. The little chip chip chipping away continues, and accelerates. Many of you have even been granted meeting up with other beings, and soon shall you all. Now, let us rattle a few cages. Sit back and let it all unfold, as it is all a part of God's plan. You are a part of God's plan. And we did not place you here to sit idly by and watch it all unfold. You all are here to take action all in different ways and yet all together. It is all for experience and development of beautiful sparks of creation. This is true. The experience of want, both greedy, and needy, has gone on long enough. So enough is enough. This is the end of the dissension. The activity on and around you all on behalf of return is massive. You just keep on growing and glowing, and this absolutely will not stop ever. Many of you spend much time searching. Searching. You know there's more. So many of you are reaching through your being to find that more. Many of you attempt to share of what you uncover. Some sit back and read these findings, weigh them in their selves, and find that it is not acceptable. Let us just say that none of you are totally clear. We are cheering for those whom step forward and share easy to read others' work, and some even find it reasonable to respond in shall we say less than a loving nature. So now we offer a challenge. We challenge all, and we mean all, to do the incredibly difficult work it takes to go within and face yourselves. To face all that you have done, to root out the seeds of poison, and to cultivate the ability to quiet the little me. Then you shall have the joy of connecting yourselves directly with those whom have sent the message, and take it up with them directly. Every one of you, and yes that's in quotes for a reason has this ability. It is not cultivated by sitting idly by and watching. It is hard work and devotion. When you make the decision to do this both for little you, and for all you will see the errors you perceive in a softer light. You will then be able to bring through your being of what you find as well. Do you have enough desire to reach into the unknown, and yes that is also in quotes for a reason. In the coming time this will be common, and develop into clearer telepathy. It takes work. Up to the challenge. We love you, it matters not what you do or do not. Mother or Father God.